Hello everyone, this is Joel Heitkamp, host of News and Views. Thanks for joining us here on Another Mile. I have to uh, talk about uh, someone I served with for 14 years in the North Dakota Senate. He actually served a little bit longer than what I did. Uh, Bob Stingham came into the Senate one session before I did. And uh, the one thing about Bob Stingham was he certainly rose to the top of his caucus. He was the majority leader for a decade. Um, he ruled that caucus at times uh, when many caucus members maybe weren't uh, necessarily his best friends, but he ruled that caucus and nobody could beat him. And that says something. That says something about leadership. It says something about the mark of the man. And it says something about uh, how that individual was able to keep that alliance of caucus members still together. Bob Stingham died, and he died in or near Homer, Alaska, in a car accident, a one-vehicle car accident. It appears that he was driving the car, and he was thrown from the car without wearing a seatbelt. Um, that's a loss. That's a loss to North Dakota. I maybe didn't agree with a number of policies that Bob Stingham pushed. Uh, there's other issues that we would have disagreed on. But the fact of the matter is Bob Stingham was willing to serve his state in a capacity as state senator. And that always says a lot to me. That when you put your name on a ballot, you're done just being somebody who complains. And I have a lot of respect for Bob and what he did for the state. I'm sure this is going to prompt a lot of discussion. It's going to prompt discussion all over again about the North Dakota seatbelt laws. Who supported them? Who didn't? It's going to prompt discussion about other issues uh, when it comes to legislators. You know, right now is a time when, in my personal opinion, we should be thinking about Bob Stingham's family and what they're going through, the pain and the suffering. And so I just want to make sure here on Another Mile with Joel Heitkamp at KFGO.com that we keep that in focus, that we remember that that family is grieving and our thoughts and prayers need to go out to them. Thanks for riding with me, and we'll see you down the trail.